all right uh, good evening one and all welcome to my video in this video i'm going to be talking about uh, basically a very interesting problem or this might be uh, this this you might face or you might encounter with uh, one of these issue so let's say you're working with json whenever you're working with api you always have json let's say you have a json in, in that json you have a date which is basically uh, you want to sort it sort that json so let me just uh, show you an example on um, uh prove it what i want to say so basically let's say you have a json and you have a date so you want to sort this json array based on the date so how do you even do that so i'm going to be showing you that and the second problem is basically what if the json value has null strings in it how do you even encounter with that like whenever you're doing with data cleaning data processing apis or back end work you would often encounter encounter with such problems and you have to uh, deal with them right so let me just remove the null values for now and um, so i have this json and the date is basically a string date right i want to i want to sort this based on uh, this date so how do i even do that right so in python i can uh, do that with just one line of command because i was doing my back end work since i was making api and i encountered this problem and i had to uh, look at couple of stack overflow flows basically and after that i just and got it how to do it so guys the way you would do that is basically you would say let's create a variable called temp okay you would say sorted right now in this sorted you would pass the json data after that you would pass a key and that key would be a function remember so i'm going to pass a lambda function that is a um, single line function lambda x and what we would do is basically we would say date time dot strp time right and now we are going to go in that json data so remember it's date right so in that json data it's date now now we need to specify the formatting of that data or like what format the date uh, it should work with so in my case it's year month and day like with the slashes right that's pretty much it now i'm going to show you one one more interesting case that you might encounter while you are do dealing with json or backend problems so so far so good right so it did uh, like you can see first then fifth and then seventh now you might encounter this problem um, i had this problem <coughs> excuse me so let's say you have even a null values now if you have a null values or any garbage string now your code is going to break so uh, what i mean is if i run this breaks right because see null does not match with that format so the way to trick this or to the way to handle that would be something similar so you 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 would use basically sorted now what you would do is basically you would pass the data again you would say key now we have to do some like logic here so we would say lambda x colon and now we'll say you know we'll provide some condition that condition would be something like this so i'm going to write that condition in this i'm going to say x of date right if that is equal to equal to null right if it is equal to equal to null return x of date right x of date and we would say null values here right else we would just return the normal date right so this is the solution guys um let me actually So now if i run it sure enough it does the sorting so the null value was also taken care so these kind of uh, things you would encounter a lot uh, as a software engineer or as a api if you're working on back end you would often encounter when you are working with json always remember the data is always not perfect you you won't just expect that you would have all the dates another scenario that might be one you know there might be something like this also like all sort of stuff so for that you can do first of all you need to do data cleaning so you would bring the, all the dates into a standard format and using regex and then basically 
you would do the same method that i just showed you so these are the couple of tricks and um, tricks that i wanted to share with you hope you have enjoyed this video and uh, i hope you um, have any questions so if you have any questions uh, please uh, do list your questions in the comments and i would be very happy to assist you so i hope you have enjoyed this quick python tutorial on sorting json data uh, basically which has a date as a string right so that's it for this video hope you have enjoyed it and see you guys in the next video goodbye